peace family peace 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 okay so i hope you guys are having a phenomenal day honey it's like 5 28 in the morning i had woke up like i think it was like two after two o'clock this morning um to use the bathroom and then to meditate i kept getting this urgency for me to meditate for 10 minutes and after during my meditation session um it was something that popped in my mind um like a download for me to look up 13a pertaining to consumer law and i'm still trying because i did look it up um but i'm still asking source for clarity okay but this is the reason why i came on here so earlier today well yesterday um, my oldest son had came to my house, okay, and my oldest son is 21 years old, and I have to say, boy, do he make me laugh. So when he came here, one of the things he had said to me, because I started telling him how I'm listening to um, Kevin Tredone, okay, and Kevin Tredone, he had um, made a series, a series um, of audio tapes and um videos and stuff like that um the main one is your wish is your command okay and um i listen to their audio pretty much during damn near every day okay it's so so good so anywho so i'm telling my oldest son about you know the audio and stuff like that and what i've been listening to and all these different things right and um, my oldest son goes, he says to me, he said, you are like a person that is always selling something. <laughs> you are like one of those people that's always selling something. Every week you got something different. You got something new, right? Because at this point in time, he left out of my, he, he said what he said, left out of the room and then came back in the room. And at that time, when he came back in the room, I was doing full body tapping. Okay. So full body tapping is pretty much associated with, uh, um, meridian roots. I think it's called, um, Honey, you know what I mean, okay? <laughs> so basically, you tapping out all the stagnated energy. You tapping out um, energy, negative energy, okay? Energy that's not serving you, okay? So my oldest son comes back and he starts shaking his head. And it was the funniest thing to me. And I told my oldest son, I said, listen, I'm glad you acknowledged this, Okay? Oftentimes before I probably would have been, you know, feeling some type of way, letting the ego, um, you know, pretty much say, oh, well, you know, you always changing like that's a bad thing. Right. Um, so I told him, I said, you know, I'm glad you acknowledged that because that just pretty much means that I am not going to stick to something that is not working. Right. So whenever you're changing, okay, it's going to be, be people, right, that is not going to understand the assignment. They're not going to get exactly, you know, what you're doing and, you know, that you are like a goddamn flower. Either you are, you know, growing or you're dying, right? And so that's what I told my son. I said, you know, we should always be growing, right? And that is so important. So when people are telling you like, oh, well, you tried this thing, you tried, let me tell you something. Okay. I done tried network marketing. Okay. On this here, on my journey. Okay. When I first started doing these videos, I done tried, um, let me see, two different network marketing companies, um, was about to go into a dirt network marketing company pertaining to life insurance and, the company, phenomenal company, even, you know, the, the, the founder of the company, um, Patrick, I can't think of Patrick last name. Um, but, but phenomenal, um, company, but it was just something that my spirit just was saying, like, you know, you don't try these things. Stop looking outside your existence for whatever it is. Stick to the root stick to i was gonna say routine but stick to the program okay stick to the thing that 
you've been created to do instead of doing all these different things. I am a firm believer that everything that shows up in our lives, it is showing up for a reason, okay? And we have the choice, right, to keep on doing the same exact thing or do something different. And whenever we get, you know, the the lessons from whatever it is, it is for us to do something different. And if you actually really got the lessons, then guess what? You will not repeat the course, okay? So I wanted to do a, re a video. I was, you know, had the lights off and then it was an idea that popped in my mind. And nowadays I get like so many downloads and I do believe is because of my, the way I eat now, okay? Um, is you guys know I don't do meat, okay? Um, well, I, I had some crackers, well, these cookies and the cookies did have eggs in them, but I threw those cookies out. Okay, but I don't do, um, I don't do meat. I don't buy meat from the store or anything like that. Um, mainly I've been eating very healthy. Okay, um, still doing some of the vegan, um, process, but not as much. Okay, because it's a part of me that's just like, no, like I'm proud of myself. Also, let me just say this: I'm I'm very proud of myself because earlier I was I was thinking earlier too. I went to the supermarket and um, I had passed, I went through, I, yeah, I went through the chips aisle and I did not get any chips. And I remember listening to, uh, what's her name? Um, vegan something. And one of the things she said was, instead of eating things that are comforting us foods that are comforting us um eating things that really don't have no um nutrition to it but we tend to eat those things because of whatever it is that we may be um growing through or whatever it is instead of facing it we turn to food to soothe us right and I'm so proud because when I went to the supermarket, I did not get no chips, okay? My children got chips, but I did not get any chips. So understand that this is a learning process. Understand where you are is where you need to be, okay? And you have to have this attitude where as though you, you have like this nonchalant about you. Like if it happens, it happens. If it don't, it don't because... Everything that we tend to be going through, it is in the betterment of us, okay? Like, like, let me, you know, let me just say this, okay? Like, for instance, okay, um, when T-Mobile had um, denied my negotiable instrument, okay? Now, I was a little upset about that, but afterwards, what I realized was, that was the betterment of me, okay, for them denying it. Because what that did for me, it made me want to go deeper into consumer law. It made me want to go deeper into finding out what was the violations that they they are violating. What what rights are they violating of mine, right? Like, you know, the, the fraudulent contract, okay, the, the securities fraud, whereas though everything is supposed to actually be disclosed, you're supposed to have full disclosure, okay, in those contracts, okay, like, for instance, right, when you sign that document, okay, stating that you're going to be doing business with them, and you sign a document, and they supposed to disclose to you that actually you are front end of money, okay? And also the payments that we receive each and every month in a meal, okay, that they say you have to pay, right? And if you notice, it's, not, it's never a negative. It's always in a positive form because those are credits, okay? Did you know that? Because I know damn well, I didn't know that when I signed up for T-Mobile. I also didn't know that they would be selling my securities, okay? That the application, once I filled out their application, would then turn into security. I didn't know that, okay? I also didn't know that 
everything was pretty much paid for through my estate. Okay, didn't know that either. Okay, the sister, the, the sister came by and trust. Okay, didn't know that. All right, and you know it is it, is so good. It, I, I, you know, I'm, I'm really enjoying life. Okay. Even if it feels like you are being denied something, honey, they cannot deny you. They may say it, but they cannot deny you. Okay. And the more you are researching, let me tell you something about researching. Okay. The more you are researching. Okay. It's like the more you have armor. Okay, instead of being angry and disgruntled about whatever it is that's going on, use that same energy to study. Okay, use that same exact energy to study because one of the things that you have to understand is you are capable, you are smart enough, okay, to see past the deception. Okay, all right. So keep on going, keep on growing, and keep believing in yourself. And with that being said, I love you guys. Peace.